Good morning, happy, happy Monday. I hope you all had such a wonderful, relaxing, rejuvenating weekend. Um, I was thinking about this. I've actually been thinking about this a lot over the weekend, um, purely because of some conversations that I've been having. Thought I'd share that with you guys for a little bit of Monday motivation. Um, you know, a lot of the time in life, people will not necessarily be able to see who you are at your core. And, um, you know, I, I used to really struggle with people thinking I was something that I wasn't um, or having another perception of me that I really didn't want them to have. Um, and I used to live a lot of my life trying to make those people really understand, no, I'm not like that. I'm actually like this, I promise. Like, and really, really put in so much effort to try and show those people what I was actually like. And I realized that actually that then took my focus off actually trying to be the person that I want to be and actually being those qualities. And I thought about why those two differ. And I realized it's purely intention that when I am trying to prove to somebody that I am something or these qualities, then actually the intention behind why I am acting in that way is to prove something rather than because I actually want to um, have those qualities or actually am trying to be that person. Whereas when I'm focusing on just being me or just trying to um, imbibe those qualities in my life, the focus is to be able to give that to other people. And so really the intention almost changes the quality without us even realizing it can be subtle where we don't realize it's actually changing that quality to be less powerful when we're doing it with the different intention of proving ourselves. Um, and so I just thought I would share that because it's something that, um, yeah, you know, people are always going to, always, always going to, um, there will always be people in your life that don't see you in the way you want them to. And so you just have a choice of whether, do you want to spend your life trying to prove to them that you are this other person or that you are the person that you think you are and that you know you are? Or do you want to just spend your life trying to grow that even further to affect people's lives or to um, give that quality to people who are ready to receive it? Um, and so, yeah, I thought that was really, really powerful for me, especially because um, I've been thinking about it a lot. And then I also read um, something this morning, which I thought I'd share, and it's by Radhanath Swami. And he says, I'm going to just paraphrase because I've already posted it um, on my stories, but he, he says along the lines of, I don't know anybody that has ever really genuinely given love or care to somebody and it hasn't come back in reciprocation in some way. And so he says that if we're not feeling loved, then maybe we need to love others more. If we feel like we're not cared for, maybe we need to give out care more because generally human nature works where in the end it's all reciprocal whether we are giving love to somebody and they're not receive they're not giving it back to us often we're receiving it from somewhere else and we're just not aware or many times we're just not giving enough to be able to receive um, and so I thought that was really interesting too because it's like if we're not feeling understood then maybe we're not understanding others well maybe we are judging other people and so other people are judging us too so that really kind of played into what I was thinking about as well so I thought I would share that too um, and so that's it really that's going to be my focus for this week to really focus on um, why I really focus on trying to keep these qualities going rather than trying to prove the qualities to other people. Um, and also realizing that anything I feel I lack in my life is maybe because I'm not giving that enough to other people um, in some way. So um, I hope that's something you'll focus on me too. These are the last few days of Karthik. Um, and so, yeah, really trying to keep whatever it is that you have taken on this month going as a life practice rather than just a practice that you're trying to do for 30 days um, and even if you can't keep it up as much really trying to just keep a little bit of it at least something that you feel um, you've really progressed in during this time just try and continue it because it's obviously something that's really helped you or made you a better person in some way um, so sending you all so much love and gratitude for the week ahead um, thank you for all your messages and sweet words that you are always sending me I'm forever grateful for them and I learn so much from all of your lives and it really helps me see perspective on mine also and um, yeah lots and 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 lots of love <laughs>